Hey there, hello, uh, hey everyone, how are you guys doing? I want to do another video in 2018 because it is a new year, guys. I want to do more videos in 2018, so I want to talk uh, about It today. So this is going to be a horror film about It, and I bought it on Blu-ray recently. I bought it three days ago when it was first released. I bought it the day it came out, which was uh, January 9th of 2018 so uh pretty much the day it came out uh yeah got it day one i didn't want to wait i bought i paid full price for it because i was fully confident that this was that this would be a indeed a good movie i was fully confident in that and i didn't hold back at all and i just wanted to snag it as soon as i had the chance and as soon as i had the opportunity to and as soon as it was released as well uh because i didn't want to wait any longer to see this movie for the very first time because I know I I feel ashamed of, in saying that that this is the first time I've ever seen it was when it was when it was released on Blu-ray so uh, yeah but by the way I totally regret not seeing it in theaters totally regret it I really should have I, I, I really should have seen this movie in theaters but it just came out at the wrong time and I just had no way to get to the movie theaters back then, and I had no other way to get there. Uh, and that was basically my excuse for not seeing it in theaters. But yeah, oh man, like the biggest regret I've ever had in my life. Uh, definitely. It's definitely up there with one of my biggest regrets ever. Um, yeah, so yeah i i went ahead and paid the full price for it because i was fully confident like i said earlier i was very confident that this would be indeed a very good movie and i was totally right absolutely totally right uh because this movie is one of the best horror films of this decade it's it, it's definitely up there with like uh well yeah uh, the devil's candy or uh you know, the Evil Dead remake, or, you know, like, this is, like, this was a remake that definitely need to, needed to happen, uh, for sure, uh, because the original, uh, uh, miniseries, actually, I've never actually seen the original miniseries of it, and, um, now, this particular movie is actually based on Stephen King's original novel, which, I think, I believe the TV, well, well, the, uh, the miniseries was also based on uh, Stephen King's original novel as well, uh, yeah, so, I pretty much loved almost every single thing about it, I definitely did, uh, have a really, really good time with it, and I, I, I mean, I, I feel ashamed of myself in not seeing this movie in the theaters when I totally was open to it, but just, I, I just didn't, I, I had no way to get to a movie theater back then, like I said earlier, but, um, yeah, oh my gosh, like, this is one of the best films ever, um, I do have one, one flaw with it, though, and I will probably get to that in my full review of it, but for now, this is just gonna be about, basically, like, my experience with it, and how I saw it, and that sort of thing, um, yeah, I mean, just from the acting, from all the child performances, from all of the uh, suspense, from all the thrills, from all of the great scares that it has, and it does have a few humor here and there too as well, and and I do believe that uh, Stephen King's original novel was actually it actually took place in like the fifties I believe, and this film actually takes place in the eighties, in the in the late eighties by the way, and and it, like it, there's it, there are scenes in it actually there are a ton of scenes in Ent that r really uh, makes a lot of horror fans very very happy including myself there's a lot of hidden easter eggs that are in this movie that you will definitely uh notice especially especially if you're a diehard horror fan like i am but yeah i pretty much had <laughs> like I, I was it, it, this surprised me on so many different levels it really really surprised me when i first saw it uh, about two days ago for the very first time i've i watched it for the first time for the very first time two days ago and i i'm a i'm a big it's a big shame i am ashamed in saying that 
but uh, I know a ton of people have, have, have seen it like many, many months ago when it, was, when it was released in theaters, but me, I just didn't get around to it. But yeah, like, like I said, uh, it really, really surprised me on multiple different levels. Uh, I mean, the beginning, the opening scene was just terrifying. It was just uh, frightening. The opening, beginning scene of it is amazing. Like, it's uh, just perfection. I thought that that scene was done totally, totally well. Uh, and, it, and it couldn't have been done better. Uh, yeah, just uh, great acting, great directing. Like, oh my gosh, I can gush about this movie for hours, but I'm not going to do that here because I want to make a separate video on doing like a full review of it uh, you know, just talking more about it and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for today's video, guys. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And uh, and just let me know what you guys thought of it down below in the comment section. I will be sure to read that as well. Uh, I would love to hear everyone's opinions on this movie because I hear that it's really, really good. And now that I've seen it now, I can see why people really, really love it as well. Um I definitely see the hype surrounding it. I can definitely see people uh, rating this movie as like their favorite horror film of all time. I can definitely see why people say that it's one of the best horror films of this decade. And I believe it is one of the best horror films of this, of this decade. It's definitely one of the best remakes I've ever seen in horror history. Um, yeah, it's it's definitely up there with like, uh, you know, the Hills Have Highs remake and uh, Evil Dead the remake. Yeah, but definitely The Hills Have Eyes, but yeah, it's definitely one of the best remakes. This is a remake that needed to happen, totally needed to happen, uh, because, uh, well, the original miniseries I've never seen before, actually, but I've heard mixed things about it. I've heard, like, the first half of the original miniseries.